Bill's daily birthday segment was earlier this hour, but we're going to dedicate this out and about segment to one local birthday, and we're talking about this man's birthday, Ivan Tadic. He's 88 years old today, and not only that, he's also celebrating 70 years as a barber in Multnomah Village. He also has a great nickname. That nickname he picked up about 50 or so years ago is Ivan the Harrible. My dad started the barbershop here in Multnomah August 15th, 1933. My dad and I worked together for over 20 years when I got out of the Navy, and I'm still here. Have you thought about retiring? I have never thought about retiring because I'm going to go down cutting. <laughs> I am. But has this always been the thing you wanted to do? Was there any other thought about doing something else for a living? When I was six years old, I used to come in here I used to look at all the bottles of hair tonic and the customers were really nice to me and I liked watching my dad work and I knew when I was six years old I was going to be a barber. Have you developed sort of a specialty cut, something that is signature to you? I'm the only one left that does the Roffler razor cut. The what kind? Well, Roffler, we were franchised. The Roffler yeah, razor the, in cut? The, in the 60s, it's a razor cut, I cut hair with the razor. When you cut it with the scissors, you cut it blunt, right? Mm -hmm. I'm cutting with the razor, I'm putting a little taper on the hair, but I go all the way through the hair, section by section. When you're all through, those little ends just lock right in. What do you think of the customer you have in the chair right now? Oh, wonderful. <laughs> wonderful. Uh, I just love Ivan. He's, uh, he knows lots of people, he's got more friends than you care to shake a stick at. Awfully nice guy. <laughs> Bolo Bar Shop, I just mean. Oh, Ivan, it's our John Lee calling. Hi, John, how are you today? I treat people the way I would like to be treated. The good old golden rule, it works. National headlines are following this morning right now. President Trump's now. Ivan, do you have any suggestions for what I could do with my hair? I looked at it on TV this morning. What'd you think? I like it. Oh, I held my breath there. I was like, oh my gosh, what's he going to uh -oh. say? I like I it. Pray. Shave Whew. it off. Here's a part of the story I haven't shared with Brenda yet, and I could have told you this yesterday. So uh, he was born in Portland, born at Good Sam Hospital. 50 years or so ago, he and his wife actually moved to McMinnville. So now oh. he drives from McMinnville to Multnomah Village to go wow. to work oh, wow. four days a week. But he said 50 years ago, he moved to McMinnville, and he remembers a young Brenda Braxton. He <gasps> says he remembers you when you were like five years old. He used to go to your mom's wig shop, you yes. told me? Did your mom own a wig shop? Y yes, we did. Oh, wow. Oh, that small world. Oh, Ivan the Harrible mwah, speaks mwah, the mwah, truth. Mwah, mwah, mwah. That's fantastic. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, we moved there in 72. So, yeah. Ivan's time. been in McMinnville for 50 story. years, but in Multnomah Village for more than 70. Wow. That's a tough story to top. Uh, 